Hi guys, welcome back to Let's Play Star Wars Knights of the Republic 2. Alright, we just had a look at the Jack Jack Tar last time. Not uh, much going on there yet. But we'll, we'll be back again later. So not to worry, at least you gotta see a little bit of it. So Now I'm gonna head back to the, the Bith scientist who wanted the package from the Twi'lek. But the Twi'lek we found there was dead. And that's no good. That cleaner droid got him. <laughs> oh, crap. Oh, yeah, right, that's empty. Uh, Biz Scientist Quarters, okay. Oops. Get item. If I was seeing the droid attacked me, it's deleting my data. I would try to get. Oh, log interrupted. It's, and I think it's something about Biz is that it's its, har it's, its arm there, right? But I think it said something about that they can regenerate their arms, so I mean he could still be alive. I don't know though. So I'm just gonna take this and uh, not talk to you. <laughs> Doctor is thirty. If so, I say twice. I will not pay the departure fee. To it is as if you were taking money at Blaster Point. Yeah. In exchange, they charge high credit for leaving and entering the dock area. So even though the dock won't arrive, I found my contact was not here. The dock authority won't pound my ship unless I can get enough credits to pay them. Let me see if I can help. I'll go see him. I'll not forget to enter on my behalf. What is your cargo? Cargenic power cells, a large simony. Again, I think you can help. Could I have one of your power cells? You can help me, I'll give you one. I'll let you know what happens. Cool. We'll have to. Whoa. Talk to the guy. That uh, Twi'lek that's just out there. Open up. I don't know who you are, but you picked the wrong room to break into. No harm done. For a minute, I thought you might have been someone else. What do you mean? My wife, Ada. There's a chance she may be here on Nar Shadda. A lot of refugees ended up here after the Jedi Civil War. I came here to see if I could track her down. Thing is, I can't get into the refugee sector. And even if I could, I'm not sure I could find her. I've been here for weeks, hoping to see her face. All I've done is watch my credits burn away to nothing. Um, yeah, I ran into her. What? Is there any way to get her out? I'm working on it. I'll return when I have more. I can't believe she's still alive. This is the best news I've heard in years. Please, whatever you can do, I'd appreciate it. Alright, it looks like we're going to have to come back to the refugee sector. Alright, where's this door? Oh, another door. Magnetically sealed. Fine. Jerks. <laughs> uh, doors that are like that usually only open at certain points in the story, so you have to kind of keep coming back in order to see if they're open. It's kind of sucks, but meh. That's what you gotta do. Okay, let's talk to this guy. To talk to you about La Salle de <laughs> Pay his docking fee, he go. He can't pay the docking fee because he can't sell his power cells. Power cells, you say? I have an idea. Pile on new power supply. Thurman gives fastest some power cells and fast to let him go. Agreed? Oh, maybe you should give him some extra money. Don't worry about him. I can't talk. You go tell him? I'll let him know. Uh, nothing. I'll be going. Alright, so let's go back. <laughs> Get one of uh, one power cell for our own out of the deal. Yeah, here we are. It says you can depart now. Alright. Nice. And we get a parcel. I don't. I forget what it's for, but we got one. 
And everybody leveled up. Well, not everybody, but... Handmaiden did. Mmm, fine. Feats. Don't want critical. I think I do actually. Wait, what's this? Prove toughness. Fine, I'll take that one. Oh, I almost forgot that. <laughs> Yeah, he wants dexterity. Yeah, it's fine for me. Alright. So I think we pretty much explored everything there is to see in this area for now. So let's get out of here. The exit should be over here. Just like that. Yep. Hmm. Ah, the mighty Hanhar. You were a shark as well. How did the meeting with Goto go? Lethal, I hope. Only a shadow in his voice. He fears to stand before others in the flesh. He is strange prey. I do not pay you to hunt him, but to kill him. Wookie, perhaps I chose unwisely. Perhaps another bounty hunter scum could serve me better. You find no one who can hunt better than me. I have walked the Shadowlands of Kashyyyk and returned with the pincers of the Kinrath buried in my flesh, with the scars of battle upon him. With Yes, 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 and what is... That is why Zerka found you such easy prey. I care nothing for the accomplishments of primates on some backwater world to honor. I care only for your accomplishments here upon the smuggler's moon. But if you cannot perform the task, then perhaps the human female will serve. Mira, is it? Even nauseatingly thin and shapely, the free of, and free of wrinkles, she is said to have a dancer's grace, and you, and to be better a better hunter than you. She refuses to kill, but I imagine with enough credits I could persuade her otherwise, especially considering what a disappointment you have proven to be. Speak of her again, I will tear your tongue out from your th Ooh. Oh boy. Ah. These are my han hounds, Hanar. Just as you are. I tell you again, go find Goto, kill him. Do not return until you've done this. I'll return Vogo, this I swear to you. Okay, crazy. Hanhar is insane. Actually, he is. <laughs> but that is for another matter. Alright, let's uh, do some more exploring here since we're back out at the docks. Maybe they go back to the refugee sector. Sucks, I know. But actually, we're not going to do that yet. I want to go back to the, uh, that cantina. Where is it, though? Ah, there it is. That we went to before we decided to be a dancer. What was it, Andar, that we had to... Uh, she seems pretty harmless, so I'm letting her stay. <laughs> I don't promise you anything. Fine, whatever. And yeah, we were supposed to sell a droid to some guy, weren't we? Ah, I forget. Anyways, let's go in here. Alright, we're back here in the cantina area. Um, let's go over this password. If I don't know the password, then you can't get in. Apparently we need a password to get into the Zack Den. Maybe this guy knows it. Fine, I guess he can't. What about this guy? Fine. 
Uh, well, we'll do some more exploring in this area. Okay. This obviously seems like a bar. Yeah, no room at the table. You want to get away. Our conversation, human. Not for your ears. Alright, so what we have to do is actually, uh, be stealthy, I think. So what I'm gonna do is go stealth or solo mode, and put a. Okay, fine then. I hear you. I'll do it this at. Wait here. And maybe we'll be able to hear what they have to say. I think I have to be on this side. I thought. Did I just scare him to death? That's funny. <laughs> I have never knew that you could do that. Oh, that's crazy. Alright. <laughs> Let's see if we can sneak over these guys. Boga the head make big trouble for all of us. It is exchange boss Godu who make big trouble for Volga, who get mad then make big trouble for all of us. Long chain. Volga not even see visitors now. Not unless they come to talk to him about Godu, he not let them in. All he sees... Uh, Godu consume Volga like big Gundark. Volga be big, big mealy even for Gundark. Alright, so we got uh, some entry points. <laughs> Let's try that again, see what happens. Oh, I don't know, anyways. Let's uh, take Solomon off. That is so funny. I thought there was a guy in here. So, you have the look of a seasoned spacer about you. What bat was you looking for? No, anything interesting about well, the area? Honestly, there's not much for people like you and I to do around here. If you uh, catch my meaning. Uh, what do you mean? Well, our kind isn't exactly the majority on this planet. Well, there is plenty for them to do. The Pazak Den, Swoop Races, the Jet Jet Tar. They're pretty much taken care of. Pizak Den? Yeah, the Pizak Den is a glorified social club for hardline Pizak players. It's exclusive, though, with a guard at the door and a password needed to simply get in. Don't know why you'd want to get into that place. Bunch of Faraxa sharks will strip you clean of your credits. Especially the champ. The champ? He only shows up to play people he deems worthy enough. You'd just have to beat about everyone in that place before he'd even think of coming out of hiding. Two braces? Ah, don't bother with Lupo's racing gallery. The track's deadly and the betting's awful. Born and Liz keeps threatening to take the place over and run it. Now there's a place that's literally deadly for our kind. Jet Jet Tar is a bar filled with cyanogen gas. It's poisonous to you and I, but the aliens drink it up and pay good money to do so. The cyanogen gas also acts as a social buffer, since the people who typically frequent Jack Jack Tar aren't interested in speaking to the likes of you and I in the first place. Okay, fine. Ready. <sighs> well. Equip my weapons again. Always seem to unequip them. Okay, so we're gonna need to find the password for that stupid thing. But I thought one of these guys were supposed to tell you. I'm gonna get him to come out. Try harder. <laughs> and that little dude. Let me see again. I want you to know where I stand with the exchange. He's watching you all the time. He may have exchange energy. They don't like you in their affairs. Change the stick. I put a cost you. Whoa, 2,000? No, thank you. Alright, let's see what else we can do here. Stories. What do you say that? You're just different than the humans come here and shift the biggest change. Credits, yes? Here to crush the exchange, and that's all you need to know. 
kill the cat down and you see it's changed very very bigger bigger than the whole planet I killed planets before I could do it again <laughs> we'll see about that ah, I blow up freaking planets man don't mess with me okay well I think that's gonna be pretty much it for this episode guys um, so Godspeed stay frosty we'll explore more of Narshad on next time Let's be see frosty. See ya.